Good morning, everybody. This is uh, 11 a.m. This is day five of my uh, ankle um, being bruised and broken. So, <laughs> uh, sorry, that's my that's a person lawn uh, mowing our lawn. So, um, I've uh, had a pretty good day yesterday. Uh, I was able to actually get on my foot and move around quite a bit. Um, the bruising has considerably gone down, as you can see there. It's a lot better than what it used to look like. So I'm very happy about that. And, um, but yeah. Um, my, my, uh, my, my roommate and I went over to, um, went over to the berry barn that we have here in this place, which is like eight minutes out of town. And, uh, it was, it was very beautiful because we were, uh, since I, excuse me, since I live here in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, there's this place called the Saskatoon Berry Barn, which grows Saskatoon berries. And, uh, it was the first time I actually was able to eat uh, berries straight from the, uh, berries straight from the vine, and it was so good, it was tasty, unbelievably tasty, and, uh, I was really happy that we went out there, because we went for a good walk, and then, uh, after we finished, we went to the restaurant, had some to eat, I had a nice, um, nice waffle with some fruit topping on it, so, never tried that before, it was, it's really good, uh, if you guys ever thought about having, uh, fruit on top of your, fruit on top of your waffle or pancakes or anything like that, please do it. It's delicious. Never had that before until now. Until then. Uh, just get some light in here. There. That's better. Okay. So anyways, yeah. So we were doing that. And then uh, we decided to um, take a trip on the other side and uh, on the other side of the river that the Berry Barn was close to. And, uh, you know, had uh, dipped our feet in the water, so it was really nice. And, uh, so, it, it, was, it, was, it was really good to be able to get out and actually stretch my feet out, so. <laughs> uh, in regards to uh, questions, uh, I was given another one by Savani, and uh, he wanted to expand on the whole uh, being shrunk down to the size of an insect. And say, like, uh, what would be the purpose in life for being shrunk into an insect? And also, what about someone that you disliked? Uh, being shrunk down to an insect. Uh, well, the funny thing is that, like, uh, today I don't have a lot of people to dislike because I just, I don't, I don't, I don't see them as enemies. Or, I guess just people that really frustrate me. I guess, like, um, I probably, if they shrunk down to the size of an insect, I wouldn't stomp on them. I can tell you that right now. Um, I'd probably just keep them safe. And, um... You know, it's sort of like, uh, I, <laughs> I keep them safe. I wouldn't hurt them at all, which is really funny, uh, cause you know, the saying goes, it's, um, uh, well, I guess I don't, okay, sorry. I don't, I didn't mean what's saying, but it's like, uh, I don't keep grudges. I don't keep grudges with people. That's why, <laughs> um, I'm just, I'm just that sickening, sickeningly nice, I guess. I don't know. But uh, the purpose in life would, uh, for being shrunk down to the size of an insect would be probably the research the lives of an insect and dust bunnies. Mm. You can do that. <laughs> also, check out the uh, all the. You can also record yourself by climbing up different obstacles, like uh, say, like a TV or even just a table or even just a rug for that matter. Like, know what that's like. So, <laughs> um, but yeah. So far, it's going pretty good with uh, with the ankle. I'm very happy with it. Um, it's, it's it's healing up surprisingly well, even regarding that I have a broken bone inside. But uh, you saw it. the bone's going really well. So, and the other one was from uh, a user named Evan D that said, "What kind of dress shoes do I have?" Uh, just the normal standard dress shoes that uh, that are actually getting a little small on me because I had them for a few years. So I need to get a new. I get a new, I got to get a new suit anyway. So. Because uh, I'm probably going to need it when doing like uh, professional acting shows or things like that. So, so, uh, but yeah, I forgot to mention I am a professional actor. So if you guys have any questions in regards to acting, please tell me. Please let me know. I want to answer them. And uh, and uh, not a lot in regards to games this time for questions. But yeah, if you have any ga uh, questions about games, just let me know. I will uh, I will definitely answer them for you because uh, you know I think that's pretty uh, that's pretty important. <laughs> And uh, there was something from uh, Lauren Goodnight that said, uh, "Good to see you up and up and going." Thank you very much, Lauren. I really do appreciate that. And uh, let's see, just some more well wishes and uh, and you know get well soon. That's pretty much what it was. So, 
this is going to be this is a very short uh, vlog, but I want to say thank you guys very much for uh, for sticking with me. I really do appreciate that uh, you guys are sticking around. I actually earned one more subscriber as well, so <laughs> we're at 139. Very happy about that. I want to say thank you so much. It goes to show that you guys really do care and and really do support me in, in making sure I get to good health so I can uh, get back up and walking and, and doing all that cool stuff. So, um, so yeah, I want to say thank you, everyone, for, for, be, for sticking with me. Thank you, everybody, for just being there for me. And uh, we'll keep these vlogs going on. Ask me anything that you want. i got Facebook, Tumblr, Twitter... And uh, still working on that inst Instagram, and uh, we're going to see how it all goes, okay? All right. You all take care of yourselves. We'll see you tomorrow. Love you all. High five.